is that the patients who have hit a plateau or who are coming off traditional therapy services or ones that you may not consider as a traditional therapy candidate um, can actually be considered because it gives you an opportunity to kind of get rid of the plateau. It, it gives you that opportunity to give them something different, to stimulate their brain in a different way, to stimulate their muscles in a different way, and then take that and move it into something more traditional in therapy, standing balance, walking, transferring, in a, a bed mobility, being able to put their shoes on and off, um, just the response time. For a lot of time, you know, the lower level patients, you may just be looking at response time. How quickly do, do they follow something to the left or to the right? And you'll see faster, faster improvements in their response time, which for Parkinson's patients, for patients who haven't been mobile, who might have limited communication. Uh, for swallowing dysphagia patients, they actually then are turning their head to the left and to the right and those same neck, neck muscles that are used for helping the head move are responsible for helping with swallowing. So you see an improvement in swallowing. So even the lowest level of patients you can reconsider for skilled therapy because you have an adjunct tool that allows you the ability to kind of get rid of the plateau.